Hey, 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 Leo. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your Monday, June 22nd to the 23rd. Intuitive Love Tarot read. This is for my Leo's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter in North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Leo, if you would, before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading with me, information can be found in the description box below to my Etsy shop. And I'm going to pull four cards here, Leo, and then get a channeled message from Spirit just for you. So let's see what's going on with my Leos. That card keeps coming up. It's the reunion card. Three of Cups. It's come up for a lot of signs. I mean, there's a lot of planets going retrograde. Oh, you got five cards here. So that's not surprising. People from the past coming up. Three of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. The Magician. This is my favorite card. I love that card. And the Hanged Man. Pisces card. Let's see what's at the bottom of the deck for you, Leo. Ace of Swords. All right, let's... Get this message for you, Leo, and see what's up with Spare. <sighs> They're saying, settle down your excitement. You're going to get excited about something, Leo. And they're saying, don't get carried away. You're going to be very excited about something. rationality they're wanting you to be rational about whatever it is that you're going to get excited about be rational about it okay okay thank you all right i think you're going to get truth and clarity on something leo truth and clarity is coming now this could be within you this could be within another this could be both right we do have the reunion card here and it seems that this reunion um we've got date you know you got a date with destiny here leo that is destiny that is fate with the three of cups here and the seven of pentacles so i feel like some of you will begin to plant seeds i want to clarify this because I'm not sure if you're planting seeds to reunite, like taking steps toward it, and you haven't yet reunited or attempted to reunite with somebody, or if they're coming to you, right? But you're trying to manifest this with the magician here. You're trying, mm, you're stopping yourself for some, it could be Mercury retrograde, things are slowing down. So, okay. Well, this makes sense with the message. If you're excited about something, right? This is this is maybe why you're slowing down. Like you're putting the brakes on something. Not to say that you're not moving forward, because I do feel you are moving forward in trying to manifest something. But you're just slowing yourself. You're not rushing. Or you won't. Even though you're going to be very excited about it clarify this uh wheel of fortune this is jupiter jupiter is in retrograde or will be ace of swords you're gonna uh, some sort of truth and clarity is going to come to you regarding this destiny this fate you may get like a they're saying a flashback now this could be to a past life interesting how are you going to get this truth and clarity clarify Two of Pentacles. Now that's balancing. That's a decision. The Empress could be involving a Taurus or a Libra. Or a mother energy. You may be choosing between two and you're going to be clear on that soon. Tell me about this Two of Pentacles again. Why is Leo choosing between two? Hmm. 
some sort of communication that comes in is going to help you with this clarity. Now, I do feel this communication could be from spirit. So you may be getting insights from spirit right now, which is interesting. That makes so much sense to me with all these planets going retrograde because everything's sort of going inward. You know, you think of Mercury, Mercury's communication. When it goes retrograde, it's sort of pulls back into that hermit energy which is going within and your higher self is you know you have access from within so i feel like you will be getting very clear messages from spirit if not dreams they could come in the form of dreams as well tell me about the three of cups yeah you're very optimistic like i said see this is youthful this is excited this is being very optimistic about the future here Tell me about the Seven of Pentacles. Tell me about the Seven of Pentacles for Leo. Tell me about the Seven of Pentacles. Well, there's the Two of Wands again. Decision. Now, this does have to do with your future. Whatever you're deciding, you know you have to leave something behind. And this is what you're going to have clarity on. Yeah, you're starting a new cycle. This is, you could be dealing with a fixed sign, a Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, or Aquarius, or a Capricorn, it is Saturn. So, yeah, clarifying the magician is the star card. This is a desire and a wish of yours. It will be very healing. This is why you're excited about it, because you've wished for this. Tell me about the hanged man. The tower something surprising i feel like this communication from spirit is what surprises you it, because if you look at the hanged man right this is the card of pisces this is being illuminated okay usually when you know the hangman's up i i read cards like um i don't read cards reversed they they'll let me know i'll feel the energy from the card and this is what i'm feeling in combination with the tower is like you're illuminated to you're having clarity via this illumination through spirit, your higher self. Yeah, eight of pentacles. And because of this illumination, you're like, yeah, I want to work on this, whether this be a reunion. Clarify the eight of pentacles. Five, you're working on coming in from out of the cold. Well, that makes sense with the three of cups here. Maybe... Um, there's been no communication here. So five of pentacles is lack, right? It's usually, it's the poverty pill, but poverty pill. Well, the card, I guess it's a hard pill to swallow, but this is the poverty card, right? But what I'm feeling here is lack, lack of love, lack of warmth, lack of feeling that warmth. And this illumination comes through clarify this again page of swords see there's that communication again pay attention to your dreams keep a dream journal what is your advice for leo wow moon card listen to your intuition okay and like i said here's the dream world again cancer pisces and be confident, okay? Six of wands. This is victory. Be confident in that you can accomplish whatever it is your heart desires, okay? And be confident also in the messages that you are getting. King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. That is Taurus energy. They're also saying don't forget to pay attention to your foundation, what you're building, okay? Focus on that if you're feeling confusion, if you're... Yeah, whenever you feel like confused energy, okay, and you're not clear, then pay attention to your heart. Pay attention to the inner self. I'm, I'm feeling this retreat inwards. Hmm. Yes. So when you, when you not only retreat inwards, okay, but focusing on your work when you're not clear will also help. 
okay? Whatever it is that you're working on for a short while. Although I do feel that you will have this clarity pretty quickly, but you just have to be confident in it. All right, Leo. I hope this made sense. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading with me, information can be found in the description box below. Don't forget to comment. Let me know if this resonates with you. I want to hear your story. You have yourself a great one, and I will talk to you tomorrow, Leo.